Hi everybody, we're back looking at the mural again. Um, this time we're focusing on, back up here, you can see, um, we're focusing on the dogwood here. It's not the dogwood that most of you probably think of. This is a red twig dogwood. And I'm trying to imitate, trying to, to do the, the light, lacy little uh, blooms that it has. It also has wonderful berries and I might tuck some berry berries in there even though that usually the plant doesn't have the berries on at the same time that it's flowering because they drop in the winter and they're not there again for spring. But um, I'm having issues as always with this piece. Um, but you know I've never really done anything this big before so and I'm a watercolor I, I've done watercolor for years and years and years and not as much acrylics. So, um, and this isn't even real acrylic. This is acrylic mixed in with house paint. So, uh, you know, which works fine, but um, it, it kind of has a more flat feel to it, almost like tempera. Um, so anyway, uh, what I am started doing was adding dark behind so then I can layer the light on top which is opposite from watercolor you don't do that but I wanted to talk a little bit about lost edges and hard edges and soft edges and to have something to have a little more painterly look it's nice to have lost edges where you can't tell as it's transitioning exactly where it transitions. So this would be a, a, a lost edge in there. And a hard edge, of course, would be like where that blue line is. It's very distinct. Um, you can tell that that is where the branch starts. There's no uh, ifs, ands, or buts about it. A soft edge is... Uh, lost edge... Uh, I'm sorry. Lost edges are like this, where you can't really tell it just fades in and and moves out so um, this piece right here needs more of that I think to make it feel more painterly as people say uh, it's a little too structured so um, I probably have put white or light rather in the wrong places trying to achieve that but I need I need to work on this some more pushing and pulling this all all it all ever is so I just wanted to go over that real quick and um, uh, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time